Hey D and everybody in the Great Homes ATL family. I'm checking on the progress of D's home. D is a great family member of ours. We were just at the orientation for her sister and brother-in-law. Did a great job on that one. You know, last minute items like there always is before you close, they'll be closing on Friday. And these should be closing, hopefully, there's no further weather issues or supply issues, hopefully mid to late Ju uh, July. And it's early June right now, so you can see the beautiful neighborhood that this is. They are all sold out. They have, I think we had nine Great Homes ATL family members that bought in here. So the barbecues and cookouts are gonna be absolutely amazing. And if you like this floor plan, they this is the gray well. Wonderful choice, MSD. Um they from what I hear they'll probably be building some more in a couple communities, probably within a 10, 12 minute radius from here. They also do a lot of building in the Noonan area, Coweta County area. So let's check it out. I think the last video I did, it was pre-drywall. Try not to get my shoes filthy, dirty, and it's Georgia clay. But boy, I love it. That black and white look is looking amazing. I think I'll go through the garage first. Start at the front door after that. The car garage. No more grading out for the house next door. All right. Drywall is going up. So here we are at the front door. Let's see if I can open this up. Yep. All right. As you can tell, gonna have absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous views. Awesome neighbors too up here. Got your covered front porch. Got the columns. Love, love, love the water table stack stone. The shutters. Black and white theme. The hints of gray is terrific. All right, let's start walking it. We got the uh, foyer area, which is a wonderful, wonderful wall here to work with. Whether you do faux uh, paint or textured wallpaper or shiplap, or just keep it as it is and kill it with artwork and mirrors and console tables if you want. Over here to the left is your dining room. What I love, love, love about this builder is that they give you these rounded corners. That just adds another level of detail that you don't see uh, with a lot of builders. So really excited about that. You notice the Crawford ceiling is going in. That's that tic-tac-toe look anchored by two windows. And then that little indentation here is going to make a great area for a buffet or again, odd wall or something like that. Got the outlet switch, so if you ever wanted to do anything lighting-wise in there, you have uh, wires running through there. Gorgeous. Over here to the right when you come out of here, of course, like a coat closet, or you could use it for any kind of closet. This beautiful, beautiful family room. If you notice, we have the, I would say maybe, maybe these are probably eight foot ceilings, and then you got the, up it goes up probably another maybe two feet so probably 10 feet ceilings here in the family room again the big thing here the wonderful wall of windows the area to do like a build out if you want to put your flat screen tv fireplace be able to go in there um just gorgeous just swing it around and one of the best kitchens, I could already tell, I've never seen this, 
I remember when Dee sent me the video when she went down to, I think it was Sonoya, I believe, to look at this model. Um, and I said, hey, it has two islands. And I was like, okay, that's a winner. Um, so as you can see, again, we have the indentation about two feet. Got this wall to work with. Again, back to your foyer. But yes, it's gonna be a two islands. One here and one here. And I guess this will be where your sink and water line is. Um, and so how awesome as you're cooking and cleaning dishes and all that kind of stuff, that this will be your view to entertain. There you go, swing it around. And then you have your bay windows right here. You do so much with this area. Again, this is where we came in through the three car garage. You know, area to do the, uh, the build out for the, like a mud room. And it's so convenient because then you have your washroom right here. It's your water line, hot and cold. The vent for your dryer. And I love that they added a window in here as well. As you can tell, they're still clearing out. I'm just gonna take a peek out of here. I don't wanna get a tree fall on me or anything like that. But this gorgeous, gorgeous um, extended patio, amazing job. A beautiful trim work inside of it here. As you can see, giving you even some more um, clear out area, which would be great. Just look at how gorgeous this is. And then the beautiful doorway, exactly what we have on ours. So this side is for, um, it gives you that double French door look, but it gives you this door to actually, you know, open up and use. I love the, the look of it as well. It's beautiful. All right. Of course, you have an important pantry for your sugars, oatmeal, cereals, canned goods, uh, possibly like paper towels, stuff like that. Such a big house, I need to speed it up. Coat, I mean, um, towel, linen, and of course, a master bedroom, the ever important, with the sitting room, so again, so you notice the higher ceilings, that's called tray ceilings. See the, you know, so the view's gonna be, if they clear out this land, it'll be sodded, and then they'll put down some um, pine straw. But absolutely beautiful. Create that whole sitting area, you could do the canopy, a more modern bed, uh, whatever you want. I mean, that's the flexibility. You know, how to put your flat screen somewhere on that wall, I have another wall to work with, and of course your sitting area, a couple great nightstands. <clears throat> of course, the hot and uh, cold, I'll be going in for your double vanity sinks, mirrors and lighting over here, the big uh, tub with the frosted glass window. Good thing is you see there's windows, and that's a huge thing for a lot of people who've been on back order. So it's wonderful that they have it in. It should really be able to progress even more and more uh, with flooring. And this is the shower area. It's like the, uh, maybe the rain head there. Uh, and then this will be all tiles and the, the door. Water closet, otherwise known as the toilet closet. A couple lights going in there, your vent, and just a really, really nice size uh, walk-in closet. One of my favorite features of this, um, this floor plan is this little wing here too. You have, again, where the sink cabinet will go, water, uh, toilet, tub shower, but look at this bedroom number two. So you said that was the master. Look at how high these vaulted ceilings are. It just gives it a, such a dramatic look. And that, what I love about it is you know, you can't even tell from the outside, right? That it's going to have such a big looking room. And you could use this as a flex room. If you want to make this into a home office, be killer for that. Of course, uh, you know, people that have relatives that can't do stairs, you can make it a multi-purpose room, maybe with a Murphy bed. I mean, there's so many different 
features to use for it. All right, head up the staircase here. And you get to this level and then you're like, oh wow, this isn't just like a foyer, this is actual usable kind of almost loft space, right? You have a couple outlets, one, two, three. So you could do whatever you want. You wanna put a couple lean back chairs, a small little table, a couple lamps. You could do that. You wanna do an art gallery, you can do that. You wanna do a home office area, amazing build out area, you can do that. I mean, one of my favorite features of this floor plan, you got the, uh, again, another closet, towels and linens. Bedroom number three, again, really nice size, lots of space to work with. You can see the double doors for your closet. This will probably be like an access door right here. But you can do whatever. You can put the bed on this wall. You can put it where I'm standing. You have more outlets here too. You want to put the bed here, put it on this wall. Lots of flexibility. The house next door is now under construction. This is one of the best, best buys for sure. And then you have your sink here. This is what's called a Jack and Jill bathroom. And I love that, you know, you'll have some privacy here because there'll be a doorway, there'll be a door. But I love that you can walk right in there and that's where your sink to wash your face, brush your teeth, all that good stuff, but still have the privacy um, and great use of space. Again, there'll probably be a door here for storage, toilet, another door here. And then another sink as you enter into bedroom number four. And again, love the cutout of this one. The big window, the vaulted edges on each side to give you that symmetry. Again, the views, right? Absolutely amazing views from up here. What's amazing, guys, is, you know, and I'm sure Dee could attest to, too, because she... She travels the world. I mean, there's very, very few places in uh, a metropolitan area like Greater Atlanta is where you could be within probably 40, 45 minutes of the heart of the city, even closer to the international airport, stuff like that, where you could even think that this would not be a multi-million dollar home. So it's just an amazing and a blessing that we live in a beautiful, beautiful area, which is Atlanta and all its parts. And to be able to take on something like this and build it from the ground up from dirt to now post drywall. And again, another great feature on this one is the surprising, this is a three level house. As you can see the two steps up and this has this whole level. This is technically bedroom number five, but boy, you could do so much with it. Movie theater room, pool table, bar area, or just a killer in-law suite. So you got the transom window in here, the tub shower and toilet, sink cabinet. And again, from up here, you can see the clear in the land. Look at the, the, the roof on the cover deck porch. It's amazing peaceful, quiet. You might see some deer or bunny rabbits over here, and it's still so close to the uh, the city. So this is just a gigantic room. Such a thoughtful layout, for sure. And then a walk-in closet, in addition to that full bath. So it's looking great, D. And I know all of our Great Homes ATL family members are super excited from you. Others that are, have built in here or are building in here, including your own family. So we can't be more happy for you and excited. And now it's uh, pretty much weeks away. So it will continue to pick up as supplies come in, flooring, paint, all that kind of stuff. Very, very good experience. All right, stay blessed and stay safe and we'll talk to you soon.